all see them? Yes. They're quite lovely, aren't they? Yes. yes. And this is the proof that I didn't just pull them out of a magazine somewhere. That's actually us together, and that's actually we belong uh, together. But those are my girls there. Um, yesterday was Mother's Day in, in the U.S., and uh, she gave me to you all on Mother's Day. Um, and so as I spoke to her last night, she wanted kudos for me being away on Mother's Day, and I had to remind her that she's not my mother, she's her, her, her mother. Not, not, it's Mother's Day, it's, it's not her holiday. But I did call my mother, and my mother, uh, I did wish my mother a happy Mother's Day. And so uh, because it's uh, Mother's Day back home, I want to wish all of you that are mothers here uh, a happy Mother's Day belated to you all as well. All right, so those are my girls. I, I miss them. Uh, they're very expensive, but uh, I miss them. Don't they look expensive? They look expensive, man. They wear me down. Anyway, uh, I love them. I just wanted to share those, uh, those with you. But as we sort of talk this evening, there's some things that I want to uh, talk about. Now, we're going to talk primarily uh, to singles today, but there's a lot of relationships. Somebody, whether you're content, whether you're younger, whether you're older, there'll be some principles that are hidden in the book of Ruth, the second chapter, that's going to be useful for all of us. Amen? Amen. 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 So I just want to pray before we get started today, and then we'll open the word to hear what God has to say to us. Is that okay? Amen. Father in heaven, we thank you for this time we're able to spend together, God, and I pray that as we open your word to hear what principles you have to share with us, about how we can have better and more meaningful relationships, God. Uh, we pray that you speak to us and that you open our ears, that you open our eyes, that you broaden our hearts, God, to understand. And then, Father, for someone that may be struggling with something, or for someone that has come here tonight, God, because they need uh, uh, underpinning or they need an understanding or they need to make a decision, Father God, we pray that the space is created as we talk together tonight uh, for them to do just that. Father, we love you. We thank you. We ask you to send your spirit to be with us. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 There are levels to all types of relationships. If we're to be honest, relationships are very common. We're in relationship with people all of the time. As a matter of fact, we were actually born and created and ordained by God to be in relationships. Uh, one of the first meaningful things that God uh, did after he, cre after he uh, finished with the six days of creation, he created Adam and Eve, and he put them to live together uh, in relationships. We were meant to be relational beings. The God himself created us in his image, and when he created us in his image, he literally said, let us make man in our image. We were born and made for relationships. However, there are three types of, or three levels,